Hello viewers, welcome back. Tally is launched today, the 12th of September 2024, a marvel of technological innovation with connected environment related to compliance. And also, they have provided native language for Middle East and Bangladesh. So starting this video, couple of videos, I will be covering the features of release 5.0. And in this video, we will quickly walk through what are the features that have been provided in release 5.0. So basically, I have segregated the features into three sections. Section A will cover India related major features that have been provided in Tally 5.0. And section two, we will cover the international related features that have been provided in Tally Redis 5.0. And section three will be covered with the new features that are applicable for India and international under the title of Global Major Features of Release 5.0. So let us now walk through the features of 5.0 and have a brief understanding of the functionality of these new features that has been provided. Let us now have a cursory glance at the features of release 5.0. Let us explore India specific feature highlights in section one. The major feature related to India specific highlight is the connected GST. A major breakthrough in technology by Tally by connecting GST compliance on real-time basis and integrating within Tally Prime. In the subsequent slides, we shall walk through the features related to connected GST. The next major feature is the automated tax calculation related to TDS section 194Q. In this release, it has been enhanced to automatically calculate tax under this section. These are major highlights of compliance related feature which is India specific. Now let us see features related to international in section 2. Tally Prime in Arabic for Middle East countries. This feature helps in seamless experience of changing the language and working with your preferred language. It provides flexibility of changing the language at any time by simultaneously using Arabic and English without losing out on any work. What's more, in a multi-user environment, each user can work in their preferred language. You can now print the amount in words in invoice in Arabic. Masters created in Arabic and used while recording transaction ensures accurate VAT calculation. Invoices can be printed in English or Arabic and also you can print the invoice in bilingual as required. Next, the multilingual is for Bangladesh, Tally Prime in Bangla for Bangladesh. All the facilities, as I mentioned, for Arabic applies for Bangla also. Let's move on to section 3, which covers features related to India and international specific. The first one is pending bills sorting. This feature in this release offers an efficient payment management system with various sorting methods for pending bills. Now you have the flexibility to sort the bills in the bills table namely balances, bill date, due date, final balances, increasing or decreasing as you wish and also you can sort with reference name in ascending or descending order. Next, a long awaited feature which is the stripe view for reports and vouchers. From this release on, you can view all reports with Stripe view, which will help you in reading the report easily and faster. The Stripe view is not only available for reports, you can enable Stripe view for vouchers also. A new feature introduced in Tally Prime Release 5.0 is instant notification with bell icon. The notification is designed to notify you about 
critical tasks such as GST uploads, downloads and return filing for Indian users. Globally, notification will be made available for TSS renewals, license management and tally prime upgrades. What's more, you can customize notifications indicators the red dot. Next is Tally plugins. With release 5.0, Tally is now providing additional services beyond the standard Tally Prime features. The first plugin is made available by default in Tally Prime will be Tally Capital. Tally Capital plugin will provide facilities like checking your credit report, getting loan eligibility details and what's more you can apply for a business loan in just few steps. Let us now walk through the features related to connected GST. The connected GST feature helps you to perform the following activities on a real-time basis from within Tally Prime. 1. You can upload GSTR 1 and GSTR 3B from within Tally Prime. No need to export into JSON file and logging to the portal for uploading. Next, for composition dealers, again Tally is providing you to file Comp08 within Tally Prime. You can now directly download GSTR1, GSTR3B, GSTR2A and 2B into Tally Prime for reconciliation. The next is a very interesting thing which is the real-time party information. Release 5.0 offers an easy and GST validation ledger master creation for party. You can fetch the details of the party master you want to create by just typing their GST number and saving the same as your ledger master. We can also view compliance history of party. You can view GST filing history for the last six months which is going to be very useful and very handy. Lastly, important feature ITC risk tracking. Now with release 5.0, you can get to know whether your seller has uploaded the vouchers on the GST portal along with appropriate tax amount for all your suppliers from newly provided report of bills payable report for GST. The next TDS related enhancement. Now the exemption limit of 50 lakh will be considered and TDS will be calculated automatically when you capture the transaction. We can now configure the party master for TDS exemption on purchase from government entities. The exemption limit per party and exempted party purchase will be auto updated in form 26. TDS advance payment can be auto calculated through stat adjustment option with integrated module of GST and TDS. Apart from this, certain product improvements have been provided. Significant facility is that moving your company from Tally Prime release 3.0 to release 5.0 does not require any migration from release 5.0 onwards. All you have to do is take a backup and load the data in release 5.0. Important aspect to note is once you access the data in release 5.0, the same cannot be opened in earlier release of Tally Prime. However, if you want to move back to previous release and if you had not taken a backup, then when you load the company in earlier release, you will be prompted to upgrade to release 5.0. Another option provided is repair. With this option, Tally gives a warning that there might be some data loss, but if you repair the data, then you can open the data in the earlier releases of Tally. I hope. The highlight we saw of release 5.0 must be quite thrilling for all of you, especially for those Tally users in India because of the connected GST that has been provided in release 5.0. So from the next video, I will cover in detail about each of the feature in multiple videos and we will see how we can leverage this wonderful feature of 
release 5.0. So thank you all once again for staying till the end. See you all in the next session. Thank you very much.